This is question number 26. It says the diagram shows triangle LMN. We're asked to calculate the length of LN. We're asked to give our answer correct to three significant figures. The question carries five marks. So here's LN. I've got a few different approaches I could take. All I'm going to do with this one is use the sine rule twice. I'm going to call this angle X and then I'm going to call this angle right here 44 minus x. We know the angles in a triangle sum to 180, so this is going to be 44 minus x. So let's go ahead and use the sine rule to find the value of x. We can say now that the sine of x over 12.8 will be equal to the sine of 136 over 15.7. From here, I can say now that sine x is equal to 12.8 lots of sine of 136 divided by 15.7. And making sure my calculator is in degrees mode, I'm going to find a value for this. So shift mode 3 to put it in degrees mode. And I'm going to do the inverse sine of 12.8 sine of 136 degrees. So just plugging this in the calculator, divided by the 15.7, that's going to now give me the value of x. We can see that that's going to be 34.9, uh, 34.495. So x is going to be equal to 34. 0.49 dot 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 and so on and so forth okay that means this angle right here writing this down 44 minus x is going to be equal now to so just working this out 44 minus the answer is going to give me 9.50 so 9.50 dot 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 so what we're now going to do is go ahead and find this length right here. So what I can say then, and I'm going to say that this length right here, let's just go ahead and call that Y. We could, if we wanted, call it LN. I'm just going to call it Y. We can say now that Y over the sine of this answer that I've got down here, which is the 9.50 stored in my calculator, 9.50 dot, 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 will be equal now to 15.7, so 15.7 over the sine of 136 degrees. So y is going to be equal to 15.7 sine of 9.50 dot 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 that's in the calculator divided now by the sine of 136 degrees. So all I'm doing is simply using this value twice Lots of different approaches. You could use the cosine rule if you wanted as well. I'm just going to use this right here. And just storing this in the calculator in case I make an error. I'm going to have now 15.7 sine of the answer. Or if I want, I can just put shift store A or recall A. And then divide this by the sine of 136 degrees. That's going to give me now 3.73. So y is going to be equal to 3.73, and that is centimetres, and that now is correct to three significant figures. So all I've done is simply now plug that in. If you want to give now more decimal places and then round your answer, you can do. That's the final answer. Ln is going to be 3.73 centimetres, correct to three significant figures.